Hello, I'm Philip Stoughton. I'm here at Apex 2016 and I'm joined by Kevin from Simplematic. Kevin, thanks for stopping by. We, we're hearing lots at the moment about automation around Industry 4.0, IOM, those kind of things. Are you hearing a lot about that and is that a demand that's being driven by any particular trend? Yeah, a lot of our customers are uh, demanding to increase robotic automation um, in their their factories and facilities. Mm -hmm. We manufacture a lot of different conveyor systems and uh, robotic automation products that are being used to help reshore jobs back here in the U.S., okay. uh, which has helped to promote automation, yeah. Yeah, and that the the um, the reshoring trend, that's to give them the ability to com compete in the lower cost environment, with the lower cost environment. That's correct. Uh, companies that are utilizing robotics in their factories are able to uh, reduce their labor costs, yeah. which ultimately, ultimately is allowing them to, uh, I guess, continually yeah, reduce costs. Yeah, Correct. absolutely. And if we look at um, robotics, we've seen lots of robotics in the automotive industry, for example, and we're used to these cage robots that fling things around at great speed. That's really, it's a bit different on the SMT line. It needs to be perhaps on the floor. And we've heard this term coming up a lot, cobots or collaborative robotics. Is that an area you play in? Correct. Uh, Simplematic Automation uh, does integrate robotics, uh, both for FANUC and universal robots, okay. um, both uh, collaborative and non-collaborative. But right. you're exactly right. Uh, collaborative robots are a huge push in the SMT industry. Uh, and it's something that we're really happy to integrate for a lot of our customers. Yeah. And we've seen them moving reels around on placement lines. And we've seen them doing jobs that I'm not quite sure we need them to do. Is it is it a solution that's looking for the right problem at the moment? Yeah, um, we have a lot of customers that are using it both uh, upstream and downstream in processes. Uh, a lot of packaging processes that we're seeing, uh, taking those final boards and packaging them in products or putting basic assemblies together. Uh, we're able to use a lot of collaborative robots working in tandem with humans to uh, hopefully bring a lot of those jobs back to the US and yeah. uh, make them smart jobs, which yeah, is kind of cool. Yeah, absolutely, which would, be, which would be very good. Fantastic, well Kevin, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for talking to me and I hope we can talk again soon. Yeah, not a problem. Thank you. Thank you for having me.